is Jesus, Alpha and Omega. Revelation 1 verse 8, I am the Alpha and the Omega, says the Lord God, who is and who was and who is to come, the Almighty. Alpha and Omega are the first and the last letters in the Greek alphabet. What do Alpha and Omega mean? The Bible reveals the meaning in Revelation 21 verse 13. I am the Alpha and the Omega, the first and the last, the beginning and the end. Alpha and Omega are the first and the last letters of the Greek alphabet. Like Aleph and Tav are the first and the last letters of the Hebrew alphabet. These letters appear together as Aleph and Tav through the Hebrew text in the Old Covenant. The meaning is the same, the first and the last. In the Brook culture, they are powerfully significant concepts, a profound declaration. They symbolize the totality of our embracing. They are reminding that God is the Lord of the time and history. These titles reveal Jesus, the Messiah, to give hope. He is the first, the creator of everything. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. Genesis 1 verse 1. He is the author and the finisher. Jesus, the beginning and the end, the glorious end. Can you give an example in the Bible? Yes, Peter. Alpha and Omega remind us about a new heaven and a new earth. It means hope to build a new society inside of the God's kingdom. It means I invite to look of our Lord and Savior Jesus, Alpha and Omega, and it moves to make change in our society. Peter, take a look at Revelation 21, verse 1 to 7. Then I saw a new heaven and a new earth. For the first heaven and the first earth had passed away, and there was no longer any sea. I saw the holy city, the new Jerusalem, coming down out of the heaven from God, prepared as a bride, beautifully dressed for her husband. And I heard a loud voice from the throne saying, Look, God's dwelling place is now among the people, and He will dwell with them. They will be His people, and God Himself will be with them and be their God. He will wipe every tear from their eyes. There will be no more death or mourning or crying or pain, for the old order of things has passed away. He who was seated on the throne said, I am making everything new. Then he said, Write this down, for these words are trustworthy and true. He said to me, It's done. I am the Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end. The thirsty, I will give water without cost from the spring of the water of life. Those who are victors will inherit all these. And I will be their God, and they will be my children. Jesus, the Christ, the Messiah, the Anointed One, Yeshua HaMashiach, Jesus, Son of God. Jesus, the second Adam, the image of the heavenly man. Jesus, the Alpha and Omega. Jesus, the Aleph and Tav. Jesus, the beginning and the end. Remember, it's time to break paradigms and prejudice. Be bold and carry on. Subscribe our channel now, share it with your friends. Don't forget, click on the bell to receive the notifications of the new videos. Did you like this video? Then click on the like button and share it. I'm waiting for you. Remember, it's time to break paradigms and prejudice. Be bold and carry on. See you soon. Bye bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye.